the, the verse says, if you confess with your mouth Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart that God has raised him from the dead, you will be saved. Romans 10, 9. Now that's a real important verse. Why do you think it's important? Gage, why do you think that verse is important? Because that's how you get saved. Romans is in what division of the Bible? Uh, New Testament no, history. The New Testament Paul's letter. Letter. Paul's letter. Paul's letter. Oh, yeah, Acts. Yeah, Acts is history. Paul's letter starts with Romans. And this is from Paul's letters. Uh, so now this verse says if you admit or you tell other people about your belief that Jesus is lower and that when he died on the cross, God raised him back to life, it says if you believe that, then you will be saved. And so that's an important uh, verse for us to know. All right, now what we're going to do, we're going to play a race of word. We're going to uh, play the dart game with it, yes. the give and take, to earn you some points. All right, now. When you find it, anchor it down. All right, I want you to look at the verse. Let's read it in unison. Romans 10, 9. If you confess with your mouth, Jesus is Lord, and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. Romans 10, 9. Okay, all right. All right, let's say the verse. Romans 10, 9. If you confess with your mouth that Jesus is Lord, and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. Romans 10, 9. Mark Gage, I want you to rest with two words. <clears throat> and pass the racer to Carter. And then I want you to come up here and give it to Carter. You come up here and stand right, right here. See how many cats you can get. Go, Gage, go. Well, that was one word. 
Jesus is. Line, line, line. 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 Yeah. Ooh. Sugar sure. made me miss it. Okay, yeah. just go hang out. Six days! <laughs> Good job. <laughs> hope you cough on the fly. I hope you do too. <laughs> what you did you get 60? Did you get 60? Oh, thanks a lot, Gage. Thanks a lot. Ready? Ready? You want to race two words? Okay. Right. Y'all ready? Y'all ready? Y'all ready? Guys, y'all ready? Romans 10 and 9. If you confess in your mouth that Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. Romans 10 9. Go, McKinley, go. Go, McKinley, I'm going to go. What? Or do three. Damn. Don't, do not erase that. Oh. I give it to a gauge. Watch your eyes. Yeah, yeah. No, I get the good players right here. Yeah. Go, right. go. Go, go. Go, go. Go, go. Go, go. Go, go. Romans 10, 9. If you confess with your mouth Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. Romans 10, 9. A favorite verse of mine is Romans 10, 9. If you confess with your mouth Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. Romans 10, 9, you will be saved through God's amazing grace. A favorite verse of mine is Romans 10, 9. If you confess with your mouth Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. Romans 10, 9, you will be saved through God's amazing grace. confess with my mouth Jesus is Lord and I believe in my heart that God raised him from the dead I am saved through God's amazing grace I am saved through God's amazing grace sweet the sound that 
get saved a rich like me. I once was lost, but now I'm found. I was blind, but now. Is Romans 10 9. If you confess with your mouth Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. Romans 10 9. You will be saved through God's amazing grace. If you confess with your mouth, Jesus is Lord, and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. Romans 10, 9. If you confess with your mouth that Jesus is Lord, and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. Good job, good job. All right, now, now.